Okay, so here's a quick video on the Remus custom exhaust slip-on for the Harley-Davidson Street and Street Rod 750. Now with it being a slip-on, it takes 20 minutes to install. There's plenty of installation videos on YouTube, but easily you can see you have two bolts just on the back there. You unbolt that from the stock exhaust and also two bolts on the silencer there. You pull it off, pop it in, do the bolts back up and 20 minutes later you have a fantastic sounding Harley Davidson. Now unlike the Screaming Eagle and the Vance and Hines competition exhaust this is a little bit more mute. It does give more presence than the stock exhaust but you're not going to wake up your neighbours at six o'clock in the morning as long as you don't heavily rev the motorcycle. So how does it sound? Well I have the short baffle in this you do get a larger baffle which obviously makes it that little bit noisier So what's my thoughts on the Remus Custom Exhaust? Well actually, I quite like it. The Vance and Hines is very noisy even with the baffle in. If you pop the standard baffle that comes with the Remus it sounds stock. So that's a great thing, it just takes two minutes just to unscrew the baffle screws there. I pop the normal one in and then if you've got to get up early or you want to go on a long journey then you know it makes no difference. But then just pop that short baffle in and you get that lovely Harley noise. Now it does sound a lot higher pitched than the Vance and Hines which I've had also on this. So I think it's down to personal preference. But there we go, that's the Remus custom exhaust for the Harley Davidson Street and Street Rod 750.